Hello Virgo, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing a very specific message. It is meant to be very specific. It will not resonate for all of you or even probably for most of you. Um, everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. If this reading does resonate for you, Virgo, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out some of your other placements. Now, today is the last day to get your orders in for the person on your mind special. It is a recorded video reading for $22 and everything that you'll need to know about scheduling is in the description box below for you as well as it's posted on the community page. But we're going to go ahead and take a look and see what is going on for you, Virgo. All right, you guys are dealing with a Libra. So this could be a past Libra that you have dealt with, somebody you're currently dealing with, or some of you guys could be getting ready to meet a Libra. We're using the astrology cards as well as the tarot today. And you have the moon. So the moon definitely talks about our inner world. It talks about... Um, you know, the way that we are feeling, okay? So I definitely feel like there's going to be feelings here. Whether you're in your feelings over a Libra, a Libra is in their feelings about you, or feelings are strengthening, growing, or developing between you and a Libra. This one wants to come out for you. Okay, we have the Two of Wands. What's going on with this Moon energy and this Libra? Here for Virgo, please. Got the two of wands. We have the seven of swords. We have the king of swords. We have the six of wands. And we have the justice card at the bottom of the deck. I'm getting a couple different messages here, Virgo. So just take the message that's for you, for you, and leave the ones that are not for somebody else, okay? I'm getting two very different messages. So the first one I'm getting, some of you guys, I definitely feel like there could be some kind of truth coming out, and it could just be a very emotional situation between you and a Libra, okay? This could be a past somebody that you have dealt with in the past, or this could be somebody you're currently dealing with. It just feels like you guys could be, be, you could be finding out a truth about... Some kind of truth could be coming out about somebody's dishonesties, okay? Or like lying, cheating, sneaky behavior. We do have the Knight of Wands right under that. Um, the Five of Swords, somebody could have been very manipulative. Look, the Moon card, a lot of secrets, okay? So I definitely feel like some of you guys could be finding out, um, you know, some unpleasant truths about a person, and you're definitely going to have a choice uh, coming up. I feel like you could be very disappointed because I feel like you really wanted this to work with this six of wands energy, but I feel like now you're cutting somebody off and really pulling your energy back here. Okay. Really detaching yourself with this king of swords. The king of swords is somebody who is not afraid to cut somebody off when it's no longer good for them. Okay. So you could be going cold on a person, cutting somebody off. I feel like this is the energy of like, I don't want to hear what you have to say. And you know, that kind of thing here. Um, so it could just be a very emotional situation here. Now, for others of you where that's not the case, I do feel that you could be, for, okay, I don't want to say this. For some of you guys, I feel like if this is a new person, okay, and for some of you guys, I feel like it could be, I feel like this person does have good intentions if it's a new person, but I feel like you have just dealt with somebody that was very like, uh, player like or liar cheater stealer that kind of energy with the seven of swords and I feel like because of that I would just be careful not to punish new people because of past people's mistakes and um, because this king of swords I feel you being very um, like head over heart and a little bit detached I feel like it's very hard for um, any new person here to you know connect with you or to kind of win your heart here Virgo, I feel like somebody could be giving you some attention here with this six of wands. This Libra could be giving you a lot of attention, um, you know, and wanting, you know, they could have interest with you and wanting things to kind of move forward or to see where something could go with you. But I feel like you're a little bit indecisive. Like I feel like you already kind of have negative expectations with this and you kind of have one foot out the door. I feel like you could be very distrusting and just kind of, um, you know, a little bit cold and detached because of what you've experienced in the past. Okay. 
So I would be cautious with that because I do feel like if this is a new Libra, I feel like they do have really good intentions here, okay? So I would not allow what you've experienced in the past to um, mess up something that could be really nice moving forward. Um, but that is what I have for you. I do hope that this helps. If this resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out your other placements. Everything that you'll need to know, whether it's about this reading or scheduling your personal readings, all of that is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys so much for being here and I will see you next time.